key river terms. The channel is the bit of the river that holds the water. A delta is found near the mouth of the river. The river deposits things that is carried down the river to form small islands and the river channel splits to flow through them into the sea or large lake. Deposition. This is a build-up of materials like soil around the river channel that have been carried by the river and then deposited to build up the land. Drain. This is the land that the river basin drains their water from. Erosion. As the river flows, it erodes the land either side of it using the force of the water. Estuary. This is found at the mouth of the river. This is where a valley has been filled with seawater. Floodplain. This is the flat land to either side of the river channel. When the river gets too much water in it, it is this land that will flood. Lake. This is a natural hollow in the land that is filled with water along the river's path. Landscape. This is an area of land that the river flows through. Meander. All rivers meander along their course. You can see examples here of meanders in a river. It is a bend in the river's course. Mouth. This is the end of the river where it flows into a large lake or the sea. Pollution. This is unwanted waste that is put into the river. Rainfall. This is the amount of rain falling in a certain time period. It is collected in rain gauges and can be displayed in graphs to show how much rain has fallen. Reservoir. This is an artificial lake built by man to hold water. It is held behind a dam. Graph of water is an example of a reservoir. River. This is water flowing from a source to a lake or a sea. Source. This is where the river begins. Spring. This is the name of where water seeps out of the soil or rock. Stream. A stream is a small river. It may form a tributary going into a larger river. Transportation. All rivers carry soil and rocks and mud and wood along their course.
tributary. This is a smaller river that flows into a larger river to bring more water into it. A valley. As rivers flow, they erode downwards, and this helps to create valleys. Waterfall. When the river comes across some hard rock, it can create a waterfall. Weathering. Rain and wind and snow and ice can cause rocks to become weathered and erode. A weir. A weir is a small dam across the river that the water flows over.